my YouTube channel. So in today's video is a Q&A. The last time I did a Q&A, it was a few months back. I believe it was like four or five months ago. So I thought for the fall, I do a nice and cozy Q&A. I asked you guys on Instagram stories to send in your questions and I got quite a lot of questions. So um, yes, I will be answering them in this video. I'm really sorry if you hear noise in the background. I just got ready to make this video. And obviously that time they started to uh, do some construction work outside of my house, which is really nice. I already closed the windows, so I hope you don't hear it a lot. It is still like summer here in Turkey. I'm not gonna lie, it is 30 degrees outside. And I hope this brings me a little bit in the fall spirit. If you are new here on my channel, I'm a Dutch girl and I'm living in Marmaris, Turkey. And I make a lot of videos uh, about beauty, lifestyle, vlogs here in Turkey. So if you like that, make sure you subscribe. I upload everywhere. Wednesday and Saturday a brand new video and of course you can also follow me on Instagram and now let's get started with the question so I've got a few questions about Turkey also some fall related questions because I said I will film like a cozy fall uh, Q&A so um, yeah quite a lot of different kind of questions but let's get started with the first one and the first question is as a fellow Dutchie what made you decide to live in Turkey so um, I answered this question also in my uh, other Q&A's but obviously I can understand if you are new on my channel or Instagram that you don't know this but I am married uh, with a Turkish man so my husband is a Turkish I moved here uh, four and a half years ago now yes four and a half years ago so because of my husband I came to Turkey obviously and um, yes I've been living here now for quite a few years and I still really enjoy uh, living here the next question is what is your favorite full lipstick or lip gloss so in the fall I like a little bit of a darker nude uh, today I'm wearing Mac Mare, which I really love. I wore this color also on my wedding day but with a little bit of a lighter pink gloss but um, yes, it's a really beautiful color, I think. I also have like a chubby stick, I believe it's called, from Clinique. I have it for quite a few years, but um, I always love to wear that one in the fall and winter time. But it's also a nude, but a little bit of a warmer nude. And I really like that as well. And also I really like the uh, Sleek Mat Me in a birthday suit. Birthday suit is also a darker nude and it's quite a matte finish, which I also like. So um, yes, that are my favorite for uh, lipsticks the next question is best candles so I am obsessed with like scented candles and I have them right here I'm obsessed with Yankee candles if you follow me longer you know this but um, yes always when I go to the Netherlands I buy like loads of them here in Turkey I can't find any Yankee candles so when I go to the Netherlands I buy like a little stash so I put them in my closet I put them here in the living room I burn them obviously so um, yes Yankee candles are my favorites this is grilled peaches and vanilla which is so lovely and I also love the spicy scents especially in the fall and uh, winter time and this is Christmas memories which is a really nice and like rich spicy scent oh this is so good and yes, I just love Yankee candles. I also have a few cheaper ones from the Action in the Netherlands and a scent chips. They are also nice, but I have to say Yankee candles are just the best. You can burn them for so many hours while the scent chips or um, the Action ones, they are quite quickly like a waxy kind of smell. They just don't smell so nice anymore after a while. And the Yankee candle goes just a really long way. And a lady told me where I always buy my Yankee candles that these wax melts, I believe you call them like wax melts, and they're the strongest. The next question is, what is your number one fall comfort food? So what I love in the fall is obviously pumpkin spice lattes. I haven't had one yet but i will definitely go get one by the starbucks here in marmaris they're just the best i love pumpkin spice it is just like drinking a yankee candle almost like it's so spicy but i love it also i love like apple pies and i kind of miss them i can't find really good apple pies here in turkey 
So if you know something, let me know in the comments down below. And I also really enjoy hot chocolate. If it's a rainy day and you're like on the couch with a nice blanket, watching Netflix with a hot chocolate, like it's the best. Then the next question is, where do you buy your clothes? So I don't have really one particular shop that I uh, buy from. I really love H&M, uh, Zara. If I go to the Netherlands, I always visit those ones. Here in Turkey, I quite like uh, De facto. De facto is very similar to H&M. Also, the prices are like quite similar. If you look to like the liras and the euros, um, the H&M here in Turkey is quite pricey. There's unfortunately not one here in Marmaris. I know there are H&M stores here in Turkey, but not in Marmaris. But here in Marmaris, I like de facto. Cotton also is quite similar to like H&M Zara. You also have Elsie Waikiki. Um, sometimes I can find something there, but not too often. I prefer de facto. So the next question is, why do we never see your husband on here? So this is a quite simple answer. My husband, he doesn't like to be in pictures uh, or in videos. He just don't like to be on camera. And I quite understand it. And I also respect that. I also like to keep our relationship like private. Um, obviously you see him sometimes in my vlogs maybe from the backside or um, not his face on it and that's fine. I decided to start this channel and um, yes he's fine with it as long as he don't he doesn't have to be in my videos. The next question is What's your favorite thing to do in the fall time? Last year, this time of the year, I was in the Netherlands. I was at Disneyland Paris at the moment, which makes me a little bit sad if I think about it. But if it's like fall weather and like the leaves are falling from the tree, I love to take like long walks in nature. I absolutely love walking in the woods. That's one of my favorite things to do. Also, Disneyland in the fall is amazing. The decorations and um, like the Halloween season there is just unbelievable. And I also also love to visit like garden centers like take a long walk in nature uh, going to a garden center drink drink some hot chocolate over there and um, yes that's my favorite thing to do actually and then the next question how many siblings do you have any nieces or nephews so I have one sibling I have one sister she's only one year younger than me and maybe you saw her in my Disneyland Paris vlogs or um, which videos we made together like the whole I believe and also in my Netherlands vlog so um, yes maybe you saw her in there so I have one sibling and I have a lot of nieces and nephews my father is from a really big family but the only thing is that my nieces and nephews are a lot older than me because when I was born my father was like 41 42 so um, I have a lot of nieces and nephews, but they're much older than me. And from my mom's side, I just have one little nephew. So um, not too much over there. And then the last question is, how do you stay positive? In the world we live in right now, it's quite hard to stay positive with the virus going on. And yeah, there's just a lot been happening in this year. I try to focus on the good things in life, to be grateful every day. I thank God every day for everything that I have and I try really to focus on the good things. And what also really helps me is to watch series or like videos that make you happy. So if you're feeling a little bit down, um, put something on that makes you happy. I think in this world we live in right now, everyone is like focusing on what they want next and not enjoying what they already have. Everyone wants all time more and better. You just need to focus on the positive things, the things you already have, that you have food every day, water. I mean, how many people live in this world who don't even have water? So be grateful and thankful and happy with what you have and focus on the good things. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this little Q&A. Let me know in the comments what kind of videos you like to see more here on my channel. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you won't miss any new videos. And of course, you can also follow me on Instagram. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye!